today we're going to be learning how to work this elegant stitch i actually think it's an elegant stitch subscribe so you don't miss out on any more interesting crochet stitch tutorials like this one let's dive right in for this stitch i'm chaining 34 which is a multiple of 12 plus 10. 24 is a multiple of 12 and i've added 10 extra stitches to that so i have 34 chains okay mm. to start row one work a shell in the seventh chain from the hook this is the seventh chain from the hook and i do a shell which is two double crochets chain one two double crochets chain three skip five chains and work a double crochet in the next chain three skip five chains and work a shell in the next a shell is two double crochets chain one two double crochets Chain three, skip five chains and work a double crochet in the next. Chain three, skip five chains and work a shell in the next. To finish up the row, we're just going to work a double crochet in the very last chain. And our row one is complete. It's just a combination of shells and double crochet. To begin row two, Chain three. One, two, three. Turn. Now work a shell in the shell. So in this shell, work two double crochets. Chain one, two double crochets. Then chain two. In this double crochet, work three double crochets. One, two, three. Chain two shell in the next shell chain two three double crochet three double crochets in that standalone double crochet chain two shell in the next shell and then work a double crochet on top of this chain three that we did at the beginning of the previous row Row 2 is complete. For row 3, chain 3, turn, shell in the shell. Remember that the shell is 2 double crochets. Chain 1, 2 double crochets. Shell is 2 double crochets, chain 1, 2 double crochets. Now we chain 1. Next, we're working in these 3 double crochets. We work 2 double crochets in the very first one. Then a double crochet in the next double crochet and then two double crochets in the last double crochet we are to have five double crochets here which you see one two three four five then we chain one shell in the next shell and chain one we're working in this three double crochets now and we do two double crochets in the first of that one double crochet in the next and then two double crochets in the next double crochet so we're taking it from three double crochets to five double crochets chain one shell in the next shell and then double crochet on top of the chain three we did at the beginning of the previous row that is our row three completed as you can see to do row four we're going to chain three, turn, shell in the shell. Now we chain two. We're working in this five double crochets now. Start by doing double crochet two together in the first two double crochets here. One double crochet and then the second double crochet. So do a double crochet two together double crochet in the next double crochet and double crochet two together again in the last two like this okay so that takes it from five double crochets to three double crochets one one two three chain two shell in the next shell chain two and we're working the decrease again work double crochet two together in this first two double crochets of that five 
like this then double crochet in the next double crochet and another decrease which is double crochet two together in this last two double crochets chain two shell in the next shell to finish the row we're just going to do a double crochet on top of the chain three we did at the beginning of the previous row row four is completed now to begin row five we are going to chain three and turn work a shell in the shell chain three now we're going to decrease again here so here we're going to work double crochet three together so start with the first incomplete double crochet the second incomplete double crochet and the third incomplete double crochet then yarn over pull through all this is double crochet three together done chain three shell in the next shell chain three we're working the decrease again double crochet three together here first incomplete double crochet second incomplete double crochet third incomplete double crochet and over pull through all okay chain three shell in the next shell finish the row by doing a double crochet in the chain three that we did at the beginning of the previous row row five is completed and this is all of the stitch repeats from here we're going to be repeating what we did in row one then we repeat what we did in row two and we continue to repeat till we get our desired length but as per usual i'm going to repeat what we did in row one for you now um, so you get a be better hang of it we begin by chaining three you already know how we start and end chain three turn shell in the shell now we chain three shell in shell chain three and work a double crochet on top of this double crochet three together so here we work a double crochet chain three shell in the shell chain three double crochet on top of this double crochet three together chain three shell in the shell to finish the row we're just going to work a double crochet here on top of the chain three that we did at the beginning of the previous row and like i've said from here on you're just going to continue repeating so repeat so repeat the instruction for row two repeat for row three and continue going to you get your desired length hope you like this stitch i really like it i think it is fancy subscribe you can see i'm giving you unique stitches so subscribe if you love crochet and i'll see you in my next tutorial